I'd like to tell you the story of Alice, Bob, Eve, and the hurricane. After the hurricane, Alice decided to donate to a Give Direct paywall for hurricane victims that she found on the Give Direct site. She sent a micro donation of about $1.50 to help those in need. Aaron is on the ground where the hurricane hit and meets Bob. Bob needs assistance. So Aaron hands a GiveDirect wallet to Bob and tells him he can use it to get basic need items at the local church. Later that day, Dave used the GiveDirect multi to blast payments to 10,000 people, one of which was Bob, at Grace's request. Two of the three available people on Grace's team approved the payment, and the funds were recorded on the Stellar blockchain. Grace is the project recovery manager for the hurricane relief efforts. Less than five seconds after Dave's payment was approved, Bob walked into the church because he needed some water. He saw Aaron there, and Aaron has the role of the trusted community champion, aka TC Champ, for the Hurricane Recovery Project. Bob asks Aaron for some water, but has no funds because his bank blew away in the storm. Aaron says, to Bob, let me check your Give Direct wallet and scans the powerless wristband with the Give Direct point of sales app on her phone. Aaron says, Looks like you can get 10 bottles of water with all you have, Bob. Bob paid for two water bottles and picked up a granola bar with his funds from his wristband and saved the rest for another day. Aaron spotted Eve in the church and asked if she could help her. Eve said, yes, I'd like some water and food like Bob. Eve also has a Give Direct wallet, but after Aaron scans it, she sees Eve has no funds in it. Eve earlier tried to hack the wallet. As a software engineer, she's got good skills, but didn't have much luck because she couldn't get payments approved from the Give Direct paywall by Grace's team. They just kept getting rejected. Eve thought about stealing Bob's wallet, but he was wearing it, and she knew it didn't contain much as small relief deposits happen frequently. On top of that, 
Aaron would probably ask questions if Eve came to the church with another wristband. So Eve decided to wait patiently until Grace asked Dave to make the next deposit. Finally, before calling it a day, Peggy, an auditor and informer who works with Grace, took some time to look at the latest transactions on the Stellar blockchain. Peggy was able to report in a donor email list that contained Alice's email. The donations were used as Grace intended and folks like Bob and Eve were getting equal amounts of help. When Alice read the email from Peggy, she decided to skip her evening vanilla gelato and donate again. The end.